Hi everyone, <clears throat> this is Ashish, Ashish Kyal here. Welcome again on uh, this platform and it's a wonderful uh, way of uh, learning and earning from the markets. We are going to look at the markets, certain live charts. We are going to understand what is happening with the overall uh, Nifty. We'll look at Bank Nifty and we will also look at how to derive targets on Nifty and Bank Nifty using simple techniques of candlesticks, price action, looking at those reversal areas identifying the trend and if there is a trend or if there is a trade setup that we can take it for today or positionally. So that's the entire intention. And uh, I, I would like to thank ET for providing this opportunity to me and all the viewers who are here, uh, a very warm welcome. And uh, let us now try and understand what is happening with the market. We can clearly see over the past week, I'll also share across the screen and my chart very soon. Before that, we can clearly see there was a huge sell off that we saw about a few days back, and then markets continue to consolidate. I'm talking about Nifty. Post the consolidation today, there is some kind of an attempt on the upside, uh, but it is yet to see whether this attempt on the upside is only temporary buy or it's a very, very significant retracement that we are going to witness. Very importantly, what's happening around uh, in terms of the FIS data. If you look at the overall FI, they have been a net seller since October 2021. And they have continued to do that every single month over the past eight to nine months, they have been net sellers, which means then, and since then the Nifty has topped out at 18,600 and continue to move on the downside. That clearly indicates that they are smart traders. They have been already out of the market much earlier and they have been still selling across. So there is no buying that we can see on a monthly basis. Having said that, uh, we can also understand that the recent fall that we saw on Nifty from around uh, the highs of 16,400, 500 levels towards that 15,190 was very sharp fast, which was significant compared to the prior falls that we have seen. And that's why I'm saying this pullback that you are seeing in the market now can be a pullback, can be a temporary rally. It can last for a few days or maybe just a day. And do we want to really play that or do we want to position ourselves in the direction of the trend? Now it is said that trend is your friend, right? You might have already heard about that trend is your friend. You should be trading in the direction of the trend. Now, how do you identify a trend? How do you go about it? All of those things we are going to look at a practical chart. So I'm going to open up my screen of trading view. We are going to look at certain simple techniques of identifying what is the overall trend. What was the last week? close and how is the overall markets looking like when you are trading you should also be aware about what's happening with the rupee what's happening with crude oil what's happening with bond market that will give us some overall perspective about the markets if you are an intraday trader it's still important that you are aware about the broader perspective so aapka market mein aaj trade karne ka mood kya hai wo pata chalega not basis of your gut feeling or intuition i am saying uh, this has to be on the basis of an objective way by way of looking at the charts by way of understanding what is happening around and then you should be looking for trading these kind of opportunities not basis of only your gut feeling because your gut feeling can go wrong and you can lose a lot of money also remember when you are trading in the markets you should be trading with a very strict stop loss if you are trading without a stop loss you can't really make money in this market because if the risk is hai. So paisa kamana bahut mushkil hoga because once you start losing capital, regaining that capital is a challenge. So remember, trade with a stop loss. There will be risk associated. Agar kisi ne aapko bola hoga 100% short short SIE hoga, he is trying to fake it. Aisa possible nahi hai because there is no 100% in this market and uh, it's all a probability game. Uh, just a, a disclaimer, we are SEBI registered research analyst and uh, my firm name is WalesStrategy.com. Now, let me share across my screen and let me show across ki what can be the possible trade today, how to go about it, how to see it. And you have to ensure that if there is a trade, we will be taking one. But if there is no trade, there is it's not necessary that you have to take a trade. So remember that it's important that only if there is a trade, you will be taking that trade. Otherwise, kuch bhi nahi karna hai. So let me just go and check now. Uh, over here, I'll hide my cam. I'll open up Nifty right now. And we will look on a very, very 
clear way of what is happening on nifty where are we and how do we see the market from here on so what we are going to do is we will first go on a weekly time frame chart just to see what is the overall trend and where are the support and resistance levels if you look at this weekly chart one very important way in which you can identify the trend is candlestick method basis of the candlestick these are the candles that you can clearly see basis of the candlestick we can see that this was the uh, reversal candle and this candle closed below the prior candle low that indicated that the overall trend had been negative on this candle which is the last week we can see that the low which was made in the last week was at 15184 now this low was very close to the gan square of 9 number which is 15190 now that is important so for the downtrend to start we need to see a break below 15190 level if that does not happen then maybe we are going to see some kind of a retracement on the upside we we are now going to look at certain price action areas price action area uh, important areas now what does it mean price action area means that suppose if there is a uh, a candle which found a support and bounced back from that we call it as a price action support area so we can clearly see here if we are looking at this chart we can clearly see the support as per this candle was here ye candle ka support tha kyunki yahan par low bana bounce back aaya same support was here low and bounce back support was here low and bounce back which means on the upside this is going to be a major hurdle matlab iske upar jana market ke liye mushkil hoga okay that is one very important information that we can make out now what is that level let us just try and understand the low of this candle if you look at the low of this candle which is at 15000 uh, 15670 okay the low of this candle is at 15730 and the low of this candle is 15730 again near around i am saying approximately so 15000 700 690 15690 to 15700 can i say that is the major resistance level on the dams major resistance so ye ek support level tha jo abhi ek resistance ban jayega so this was the support level which will now become resistance okay very clearly everyone okay now let us go on a smaller time frame chart now this is a weekly time frame which is not going to be much of a use for intraday trading or positional trading but ek judgment aa jata hai now we will go on the daily time frame if we are looking at the daily time frame we can clearly see that on the daily time frame we will now apply what we can clearly see the overall trend of the market just a second okay now here we can see that overall after the fall the fall started from the high here we can see that since about one let me count the candles and explain it to you since about 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 10 11 11 candles for the first time there is an attempt to close above the previous candle high okay after the 11 candles there is an attempt to close above the previous candle high now this attempt on the upside we have to see end of the day we need to check by end of the day if this attempt that the candle is making on the upside is it sustaining kya market is levels ke aas pass sustain ho sakta hai that is important to observe is it sustaining there along with that hame ek aur cheez check karni hai ki overall what is happening with the overall broader market in terms of uh, uh, open interest kyunki we want to analyze the open interest also is there people so there are call and put sellers who have been selling across 
the 16,500 strike price. So we want to go and check what is happening at those levels and what are the open interest chart suggesting. So I'm going to go on a screen which is go charting and as a as we are discussing these things we are not promoting or asking you to use any platform you can use any platform this is purely from educational perspective we are talking about and we want to see what is happening around at the higher open interest levels so if i go and check i'm going to share across my another screen here so if you can see here this is the chart which is showing the open interest analysis this is open interest profile इसे कहते हैं ओपन इंटरेस्ट प्रोफाइल ठीक है ओपन इंटरेस्ट प्रोफाइल इसका क्या मतलब है दिस शोज दैट 15,500 पे ये पुट है ओपन इंटरेस्ट एंड दिस इज द कॉल साइड ओपन इंटरेस्ट वी कैन क्लियरली सी देर इज बीन अज राइज ऑन द पुट साइड ओपन इंटरेस्ट एट 15,500 लेवल्स and there is a reduction some reduction that we have started seeing on the 15500 call side now this indicates that 15500 is now going to act as a support for intraday so filhal intraday mein 15500 will be the support for the market now that is the support that we can make out and on the upside we do not see any significant rise in the open interest or call side which means there is no major hurdle on the upside that we can clearly see uh, until this point so this level this is 15800 i suppose so 15800 is the short term hurdle for the market which is right now at this level so we have two levels now now try and understand we are deriving the price action support and resistance areas first before taking on to any kind of a trade so we can make out that 15500 is the support 15800 is the resistance now ye range mil gaya hame market ka now iske basis pe hame trade dekhna hai 15800 is also these levels around 750 के आसपास वी नो दर्डल इज देर वी डिराइव इट जस्ट समाइम बैक सो आई नो क्रॉसिंग फिफ्टीन थाउजेंड सेवन फोर्टी सेवन फिफ्टी इज नॉट गोइंग टू बी इजी सो विद दिस इंफॉर्मेशन फिफ्टीन थाउजेंड फाइव हंड्रेड एज दी सपोर्ट एंड क्रॉसिंग फिफ्टीन थाउजेंड सेवन फिफ्टी इज गोइंग टू बी रेजिस्टेंस नाउ विद दिस इंफॉर्मेशन इफ आई गो एंड बाय नाउ we have to go and check on the chart if there is a way in which we can continue to buy this market by way of either form an option strategy maybe selling both calls and puts or by way of buying calls and puts or maybe naked options so we will see that now once we have this info we will now go back to the chart there on the daily time frame yahan par aane ke baad mein we can see that the overall we will now go on one hour time frame so this is multi time frame analysis that you have to do if you check over here since the high formed for the first time since the high formed for the very first time nifty has managed to close above the previous candle high which means the trend has changed on the upside now at least over short term and we know this is the major hurdle level 15750 as we talked nifty is at 15600 for now we will now look at a 15 minutes time frame ignore the vertical lines that you are seeing on a 15 minutes time frame if i check can i say that the overall rsi is currently quoting at 78 levels so can i say that the market is short term basis overbought to karna kya hai fir since over short term we are in an overbought scenario and today is a buying day what do you think should be a good strategy to do think about it can i say that a good strategy right now 
will be not buying market here wait that is important wait for what let us start seeing some kind of a dip yahan se hame ek dip chahiye ek pull back chahiye okay now once we have that dip then we can start thinking of buying because by then the rsi which is overbought on a 15 minutes time frame will start relieving itself now point is until where do we need a dip that is the question so why are we looking for buying opportunity today first let's understand we could have bought we could have sold or anything the reason we are looking for buying opportunity as of now is because nifty is showing a huge rise so let me write it down so you remember that so one of the points that we maintained is 15190 as a major support which is also a gan support level gan square of 9 basis and this this is the support this is the support multiple times it acted as a support major support the next point is after this 15500 is seeing a <clears throat> sharp rise in open interest from the put side since 15500 is seeing sharp rise in put side open interest we can clearly say that basis of this we can clearly say that there is a support around this one okay the next information basis of oi data is 15800 is the रेजिस्टेंस पहले हमने प्राइस एक्शन के बेसिस पे डिराइव किए लेवल फिर हम ट्रेड लेने की सोचेंगे आफ्टर दिस वी ऑल्सो नो दैट फिफ्टीन सेवन फोर्टी सेवन फिफ्टी के आसपास देर एज बीन अ मेजर सपोर्ट अर्लियर सो दिस सपोर्ट विल नाउ एक्ट एज अ रेजिस्टेंस ठीक है तो ये सब इंफॉर्मेशन हमें मिल गई with this information we also have one more information that the daily candle for has broken above previous high previous high ke upar hai daily candle now since the daily candle has broken above the previous high yahan se hame pata chal raha this is our 15 minute chart i am talking about daily candle we can see that after this has happened आज का टोन कैन बी ऑन द बाय साइड फॉर ना कैन बी ऑन द बाय साइड ठीक है सो वाई वी आर नॉट बाइंग नाउ वी आर नॉट बाइंग नाउ बिकॉज द आर एस आई इज ओवर बॉट शेल वी सेल नाउ नो फॉर सेलिंग वी नीड सम इंडिकेशन और कंफर्मेशन नाउ आई एम गोइंग टू अप्लाई वन टेक्निक वेर इज द सपोर्ट लाइन the support that is lying on the downside can be derived by combining it with fibonacci tool so if you looking at a fibonacci retracement so that is the fibo retracement this is the move from the lows till this point that is what we saw so once we are seeing this kind of a move on the downside then we can clearly make out uh, that the support is lying at 15464 which is 38.2% retracement and the next support below that is 15424 which is 50% 15384 now those are the support levels that we can see on the market so now what we require is a move towards that 15464 around this area matlab 15500 ke aas paas se 15464 so ye zone ke andar support hai bazaar ka so we want why 1500 because we have this open interest put side why 15464 because we have this fibonacci 38.2% retracement level so what i am going to do now from here i am going to wait for seeing some kind of a dip on the downside abhi filhal hum sell nahi kar rahe we are waiting we are waiting to see some dip once we see some kind of a correction यहां पर आने के बाद में वंस मार्केट शोज अगेन अ पुल बैक विथ अ बुलिश कैंडल दैट विल बी दी टाइम वेर वी विल बाय दिस इज माई बाय रेंज ओनली फॉर टूडे सपोज 
यहाँ पर निफ्टी आया लेकिन बुलिश कैंडल नहीं बना इट डिड नॉट शो एनी काइंड ऑफ अ बुलिश कैंडल इट कंटिन्यू टू फॉल आई एम नॉट बाइंग दैट इफ इट कंटिन्यूज टू फॉल कम्स हियर देन मतलब ट्रैप कर दिया बुल्स को ट्रैप किया ऊपर इसे कहते हैं बुल ट्रैप सो वी आर नॉट गोइंग टू बाय दैट वी आर गोइंग टू बाय ओनली एंड ओनली इफ इट कम्स अराउंड थर्टी एट पॉइंट टू परसेंट एंड शोज अ बुलिश कैंडल फॉर्मेशन इफ इट शोज नो बुलिश कैंडल फॉर्मेशन वी आर नॉट बाइंग दिस मार्केट नाउ हाउ डू वी बाय दिस मार्केट दैट इज अ क्वेश्चन there are two ways to trade this either you go long on futures or you trade in options if you go long on futures the risk will be very high the other way of buying this market is by way of selling out of the money option by selling out of the money options you can possibly uh, buy this market very very uh, you can possibly participate on the long side of the market very clearly okay you can see that so how do we participate we can sell out of the money put options now which put options can we sell once the nifty is around this area we can look forward for selling 15000 ka put options because 15000 put option is again having highest open interest but since the broader market is down we will not sell the naked put option we will hedge it how we will hedge it we might also buy 14700 ka put option now by doing this we are ensuring that we are not completely naked sell on the put side because 14700 or 14800 up to you because just in case a very sharp decline happens you at least have a hedged position that is important for you to understand never sell a naked put option in this current market it's going to be very risky so overall strategy kya hui hamari abhi filhal looking at this we have to wait for a dip now i am going to also combine one more thing on this chart which is a bollinger bands technique just keep a track of this and understand what is it suggesting if you are looking at the bollinger bands technique we are just going to come here yahan pe indicator apply karenge we will apply bollinger bands here once we apply bollinger bands here we will be having a clearly clearly uh, technique of understanding the reversal area so we want to understand where are the reversal area let me just clear off the screen now yahan par i am going to go on one hour chart theek okay? hai i am going to remove fibonacci for now so we can see prices are near the upper end of the bollinger bands here so where is the support as per band the support as per band is 15360 levels 350 we know this is the gap area so we know this is where we are right now but we are not going to take a trading decision on a one hour we will take trading decision on a 15 minutes time frame so 15 minutes pe trade kaha lena hai 15 minutes pe trade lena kaise we want to see this once we are in the middle of the band so we can see that the band was contracting the band was contracting and now it is expanding which means now the trend is possibly starting on the upside but we are not buying now because we know the indicator is overbought so based on the fibonacci we get a support which is somewhere around 15000 460 odd levels that we saw by that time what will happen once we see this candle forming we will also have an opportunity for this line to come up so this will also come around this area which is the middle of the bollinger band once price is come at the middle of the bollinger band we can have an opportunity to go long so do teen method hamare hai jo confirm karega kaun se teen method hai open interest fibo and bollinger bands 
ये तीनों मेथड से हमें कंफर्मेशन मिलेगा सपोर्ट्स का हम सपोर्ट क्यों ढूंढ रहे बिकॉज वी सॉ ऑन दी टाइम फ्रेम ऑफ ओपन इंटरेस्ट की ओवरऑल आज का टोन बुलिश है नाउ आफ्टर डूइंग दिस वॉट वी आर ऑल्सो गोइंग टू डू इज वी विल गो फ्रॉम हियर वॉट वी आर ऑल्सो गोइंग टू लुक एट इज फ्रॉम हियर ऑन अ फाइव मिनिट टाइम फ्रेम ये अगर प्योर इंट्रा डे शॉर्ट टर्म ट्रेडिंग हमें अगर ढूंढना है तो हम फाइव मिनट के टाइम फ्रेम पे जाएंगे वी विल लुक एट वेर इज द बैंड सपोर्ट एंड हाउ डू वी ट्रेड दिस सो वी कैन सी दैट द लोअर बैंड सपोर्ट ऑन अ फाइव मिनट टाइम फ्रेम इज फिफ्टीन थाउजेंड फाइव थर्टी ये बहुत शॉर्ट टर्म ट्रेड लेना है तो तो हमें अभी वेट करना है मार्केट को लेट इट कम डाउन टू फिफ्टीन थाउजेंड फाइव थर्टी लेवल्स फिलहाल तो यहाँ पे तो हम ट्रेड नहीं ले सकते इट्स अराउंड द मिडल ऑफ द बैंड बट फाइव मिनट है तो बहुत छोटा ट्रेंड टाइम फ्रेम है और ऊपर स्पेस नहीं है सपोज इफ आई बाय एट द मिडल ऑफ द बैंड मेरा टारगेट क्या होगा फिफ्टीन मेरा स्टॉप लॉस नीचे का बैंड होगा तो फिफ्टीन थाउजेंड फाइव थर्ट रिस्क रिवॉर्ड फेवरेबल नहीं आर यू इथ मी सो वी डू नॉट हैव अ फेवरेबल रिस्क रिवॉर्ड राइट नाउ सो आई एम नॉट गोइंग टू बाय राइट नाउ आई विल वेट फॉर इंट्रा डे प्योर इंट्रा डे ट्रेड अगर मुझे लेना है तो मुझे कोई पैटर्न चाहिए मुझे कैंडल स्टिक पे कोई स्ट्रक्चर चाहिए विच हैपन्स फ्रॉम अ एरिया ऑफ सिग्निफिकेंस सो I am going to now wait. So five minute pe bhi time frame pe I do not have a trade setup for now. Trade setup morning me kaha tha. Once we had a gap up opening, we had a pullback, and then the high of this candle was taken out. Yaha par buying opportunity thi short term ke liye aaj se thode points ke liye. But right now there is no opportunity for us to do any kind of a trade setup. So in this market. पोजिशनली क्या हम ऑप्शन पे कोई स्ट्रेटेजी फॉर्म कर सकते हैं लेट अस थिंक दैट व्हाट इज द मार्केट लेट मी अगेन री एक्सप्लेन इट यू इफ यू आर लुकिंग एट दिस ओवरऑल मार्केट वी नो दैट द शॉर्ट टर्म पुल बैक इज अपसाइड ब्रॉडर ट्रेंड इज डाउनसाइड व्हिच मींस नेट नेट दिस मार्केट माइट नॉट गो एनी इन दैट केस इन दैट केस द स्ट्रेटेजी दैट वी कैन फॉर्म ऑन ऑप्शन इन एक्सपेक्टेशन की जहां ज्यादा मूवमेंट ऊपर या नीचे नहीं आएगा वी विल नॉट बी सींग इट गोइंग अबाउ दिस वी माइट नॉट बी सींग गोइंग बिलो दिस फॉर टू डेज अगर मेरा ये व्यू है कि दो दिन में मार्केट ना इसके ऊपर जा रहा है ना इसके नीचे जा रहा है सो आई कैन थिंक ऑफ फॉर्मिंग अ स्ट्रेटेजी नोन एज शॉर्ट स्ट्रेंगल सो शॉर्ट स्ट्रेंगल कैसे करेंगे ये तो रेजिस्टेंस लेवल है ये सपोर्ट लेवल है वो लेवल्स पे नहीं करना है वी वांट टू गो अ लिटिल पार अवे फ्रॉम देयर सो 16,000 एंड इससे दूर जाके 15,000 थाउजेंड दीज आर द टू लेवल्स वेर वी कैन स्टार्ट लुकिंग फॉर सेलिंग कॉल्स एंड पुट बोथ थोड़ा सा अगर हमें सेफ खेलना है वॉट वी कैन ऑल्सो डू इज वी कैन गो अ लिटिल अवे टूवर्ड सिक्सटीन थाउजेंड वन हंड्रेड बट देन स्ट्रेंगल में कुछ मिलेगा नहीं तो अगर आपके पास में मार्जिन है ट्रेड नहीं है तो पॉसिबली द स्ट्रेटेजी दैट आई एम गोइंग टू बी लुकिंग फॉरवर्ड टू फॉर्म नाउ इज सेलिंग अ स्ट्रेंगल सेलिंग अ स्ट्रेंगल मीन्स वी एक्सपेक्ट मार्केट टू बी रेंज बाउंड बिटवीन दिस स्ट्राइक प्राइस ऑफ सिक्सटीन थाउजेंड एंड फिफ्टीन थाउजेंड ओवर नेक्स्ट टू डेज Now that can be a ideal good strategy where we expect it to not go anywhere. So उसका stop loss क्या होगा जो भी मेरा स्ट्रेंगल का प्रीमियम मुझे इनफ्लो आ रहा है समझो ट्वेल्व रुपीज कंबाइंड इनफ्लो माई स्टॉप लॉस कैन बी ट्वेंटी फोर रुपीज सो दैट आई माई रिस्क रिवॉर्ड बिकम्स वन इज टू वन या तो बारह रुपया बनेगा या बारह रुपया जाएगा सो शॉर्ट स्ट्रेंगल में वी कैन मेंटेन अ रिस्क रिवॉर्ड ऑफ वन इज टू वन एंड डू दैट so that looks to be a apt strategy for now rather than trying to force a trade ye ek strategy hum form karenge uske sath mein dusra strategy jo hum form karenge we need to wait for a dip once there is a dip we might then start looking for if intraday ke liye we have a buying opportunity so this is how we can possibly 
trade in the market. So premium of both the legs you can possibly share, share and check ki kya premium ho sakta hai. That way you can possibly look at ki kaise trade karna hai, kya premium honga, all of those things. So great guys, I think a uh, very interesting market hai. Filal to lag raha sideways rahega. Uh, let's see in the second half ki kaise movement aata hai. And then we are going to form some trades agar intraday pe opportunity hai. Also remember if there is no opportunity, do not force yourself to take any trade. Agar opportunity hai, to trade lena hai. Aur agar nahi hai, to trade nahi lena hai. Ye bahut important hai aapke liye samarna. And one more thing, ki options can give you a lot of money, but can take away also a lot of money. So trade, always trade with a stop loss and it's going to be amazing. So we are going to discuss these ideas and uh, I hope this was an interesting session. A lot of uh, you would have been knowing a simple candlestick or price action areas. How can derive kar sakte? Aaj tag aapne dekha hoga ki people talk about a lot of jargons, big words and complicated things. We can keep it simple and uh, make it big, right? So that's what it is. And uh, what we have to do for the investment purpose, is it good time to buy? No, I don't want to comment on that without showing you the chart. So we'll discuss it offline, please. If you enjoyed this session, let me know how it was. And uh, you can also tweet it across, tag ET Market, do that. And my Twitter handle is at the rate Kyalashish. So any queries that you might have, you can just share it on the Twitter, tagging both ET and my uh, handle at the rate Kyalashish. And we will respond to your queries, your doubts, help you out in any which ways. So the intention should be to learn and trade. So I hope uh, uh, Sagar is asking, do you have a YouTube channel? Yes, uh, it's at the rate Kyal Ashish. Uh, for the recording, I think ET is the best team to help you out on where the recording will be available. And uh, I hope the session was interesting, right? Uh, in the live market, how you have to see it, how you have to go about it. And you enjoyed looking at the strategy that we discussed. Thank you very much. Have a wonderful day and have a wonderful time. Ashish Kyal signing off.